ever look in the mirror and think, who is that? You're not alone, it's a universal experience. We all do it, whether we admit it or not. One minute you're feeling like a rock star, the next you're face to face with, well, your reflection. It's a moment that can catch you off guard. One minute you're feeling like a rock star, the next you're face to face with, well, your reflection. It can be a humbling experience to say the least. It can be a humbling experience to say the least. You might notice things you never saw before, or maybe you see yourself in a completely different light. But why is it that our reflections seem so strange, so different from how we picture ourselves in our minds? It's almost like looking at a stranger sometimes. The truth is there's a fascinating scientific explanation behind this phenomenon. It's not just in your head, it's more than just vanity or bad hair days, though those don't help. It's a complex interplay of various factors. It's about physics, biology, and even a dash of psychology. Our brains and eyes work together in mysterious ways. Stick with me, it's going to be a fun ride. We'll dive deep into the science and maybe even learn something new about ourselves. If you're already enjoying this cosmic journey into the world of mirrors, give this a like. It helps more people join the fun. It helps more people join the fun. So, let's get ready to explore the fascinating world of reflections together. First things first, let's address the elephant in the room, or rather, the flipped image in the mirror. It's something we've all noticed but rarely think about deeply. When we look in a mirror, we see a laterally inverted image of ourselves. This means that everything is flipped horizontally. Our right side appears to be our left, and vice versa. It's a curious phenomenon that can be quite disorienting. This is due to the way light bounces off the mirror's surface. The light rays hit the mirror and reflect back at the same angle. It's basic physics but it has a profound effect on how we perceive ourselves. The mirror doesn't change us, it changes our perspective. Think of it like this. Imagine holding up a piece of paper with a word written on it to a mirror. The letters appear backward, almost like a secret code. That's because the mirror reflects the light back in the opposite direction. The light paths are reversed, creating a mirrored image. The same thing happens with our bodies. Our entire reflection is flipped, making us see a reversed version of ourselves. This reversal is completely normal, but it can make us feel like something is just off. It's a small but significant reminder of how our perception can be easily altered. Now, here's where things get really interesting. Our brains play a crucial role in how we perceive our reflections. When we look at ourselves in a mirror, our brains automatically try to make sense of the reversed image. It's a subconscious process. We don't even realize it's happening. Our brains are wired to recognize patterns. When we see our reflection, our brains try to match it to the image we have of ourselves in our minds. But because the mirror image is flipped, our brains have to work overtime to reconcile the two. This can lead to a sense of unfamiliarity or even discomfort. If you're finding this as fascinating as I am, don't forget to subscribe and share this with your fellow space explorers. Let's spread the knowledge. Section 4. Familiar but different, the curious case of facial asymmetry. Another reason why we might look strange in the mirror is facial asymmetry. Everyone's face is slightly asymmetrical, it's what makes us unique. But when we look in the mirror, these subtle differences are magnified. Think about it. We usually see ourselves in the mirror, not in real life. This means the image we're most familiar with, the one we see every day, is actually a reversed asymmetrical version of ourselves. So, when we see ourselves in photos or videos which capture our true, non-reversed image, it can be jarring. Section 5. Mirror, mirror, in the brain. Why we perceive ourselves differently, here's the thing. Our perception of ourselves goes beyond just physical appearance. It's also influenced by our emotions, self-esteem, and even our cultural upbringing. When we look in the mirror, we're not just seeing our reflection. We're seeing a reflection of all these complex factors. This is why some days we might look in the mirror and feel great, while other days we might feel self-conscious or critical. It's all part of the human experience. Section 6. Reflecting on reality, embracing our unique reflections. So, the next time you look in the mirror and find yourself wondering why you look so strange, remember this. It's a combination of physics, biology, and psychology. The mirror shows us a reversed image, and our brains are not used to seeing ourselves this way. It's the way our brains are wired, the subtle asymmetries in our faces, and the complex relationship we have with our own image. Our brains are constantly trying to make sense of the world and sometimes that includes our own reflection. But most importantly, remember that it's perfectly normal to feel this way. Everyone experiences this at some point and it's just a part of being human. In fact, it's a sign that you're human. 
This feeling of unfamiliarity is a universal experience connecting us all, and there's something truly beautiful about that. Embracing our unique reflections can be a powerful act of self-acceptance and love. Now for a fun fact, did you know that ancient Romans believed that mirrors could steal a part of your soul? It's true. They thought that the reflection held a piece of your essence. They also thought staring at your reflection for too long was bad luck. This belief was rooted in the idea that the mirror could trap your soul. Luckily, science tells us it's just photons bouncing around. Mirrors simply reflect light, creating the image we see. So feel free to admire your cosmic reflection, strange as it may seem. Embrace the wonder of seeing yourself through the looking glass and appreciate the unique beauty that is you.